Yo there guys, what is happening? Welcome back to another video here on Nasha Blogs. And it's that time of the year again where I announce the winter season vlog lineup. However, it's going to be very different this year. But not all for good reasons. So, as some of you may have known here in the UK, um, literally just a few hours ago at the time of recording, the British Prime Minister announced that the country will be going into a four-week lockdown. We saw it coming, it was coming, uh, and it is. It's happening. How does that affect the winter season vlogs, I hear you ask? Well, the winter season vlogs were due to start in the middle of November. This brand new lockdown will be running from the 5th of November until um, the 3rd of December. So let me try and explain why this affects the channel, how the channel will go forward during this lockdown, and when we will hopefully start the winter season vlogs, and what do we hope to cover. So how it affects the channel is, for the four weeks that lockdown happens, we are advised not to travel unless it's essential. We have to stay at home unless you're in education or working, if you can't work from home, which means we can't go out and vlog. And I, I know in the past I've tried doing daily vlogs, but I'm gonna be honest, I do not enjoy daily vlogging. I prefer uh, just going down to a theme park, spending a day dedicating to do B-roll shots and all that. So that does mean we won't be able to go to the parks for four weeks. Now, there's not a lot of theme parks open during the winter this year, but those that we will hopefully try to go to, we're not going to be able to do until start of December, which will then mean there are going to be a lot of busy queues and it's going to be busy as we lead up um, to Christmas. So how is the channel going to cope going forward? Um, I am going to be dedicating the four weeks to making as much content as I can. If you remember when we were back in lockdown back in March, I was trying to make at least two to three videos a day and would spread them out over the couple of weeks. And I'm going to say this now, I will be doing that again. Over this four week lockdown period, I'm going to try and film two videos a day and spread them out over the week. So, you're potentially going to be getting, we are going to try to do nine videos a week if we can. Um, and we are, we're still going to be creating content. Um, obviously lockdown officially starts on the 5th of November, which is actually uh, the day after my birthday. So um, I'm sort of quite happy that I get to spend my birthday with family and stuff before getting locked inside my, um, before getting locked into my flat for uh, four weeks minimum. This is the thing, this is four weeks minimum. It could go on for longer. So, like I say, we're gonna uh, create as much content as we can. Um, on the question of live streams, I'm gonna try and do one live stream a week. So the streams are gonna be coming back because you guys quite enjoyed it during lockdown and I, and I quite enjoyed talking to you a lot during lockdown and finding out um, everything sort of going on and how you guys are coping with lockdown just in general. Uh, those who don't know, I have a podcast called the Reckless Comedy Podcast. I've had uh, quite a few of the subscribers and uh, fellow vlog stars on, uh, including uh, one of my personal favourite people I've spoken to is um, Coaster Dan, also known as Theme Park Family. Uh, make sure to go subscribe to Coaster Dan. He does some really brilliant stuff. And also listen to his sort of 
podcast which is now live streams called Off the Tracks, which I did appear on, which was um fun during that first lockdown. Um, with the podcast on my end, uh, we are going to be creating as much content. Um, this is sort of a message to any theme park vloggers. Um, if there's any theme park vloggers watching this and you want to be a guest on the podcast, then um, please drop me a message on Twitter or Instagram and uh, we'll try and arrange something. I'm going to try and get some of my theme park vlog stars from the past on there. So you, you'll probably maybe see a couple of familiar faces or hear familiar faces and voices. Um, potentially, we may even do a live one uh, per, uh, per week. So I think it's now time to talk about when lockdown ends in early December, what Christmas events do I hope this year to cover? I do have a list of what we will hopefully be covering this year. And the first event that we hope to cover this Christmas here on National Box from the sort of 5th of December onwards is a celebration of Christmas at Poulton's Park. So a celebration of Christmas is uh, the 2020 social distance um, rebrand of Poulton's Park's uh, Christmas at Poulton's event. Uh, we've been going to Poulton's Christmas event now on and off since 2013 and we've seen it grow all different ways. Uh, they've got a brand new live show going on. Obviously uh, the start of the event was due to start in middle of November uh, but we do believe uh, that will be postponed. Uh, obviously all the events that we do talk about that we're hoping to do are subject to be uh, postponed or or cancelled so um just keep an eye out we will let you guys know if events get cancelled uh so this is the first one we're hoping to go to um when we're hoping to go this is likely to be probably the first event we kick it off with uh but we're not too sure we, we just love the christmas event at Poland's. it's always a really well done event the team are always brilliant and the live shows are brilliant as well so that's the first one, um, a celebration of Christmas at Poland's. And hopefully we'll get to see some uh, Tornado Springs testing as well. The next event we'll be covering is, it's Chesington's Winter's Tale. Um, so we missed out on this event for the last two years. Uh, we were going to try and get to it last year, but uh, financial issues caused us not to. Uh, Obviously, we're really hoping to get down there. This one runs uh, from mid-November all the way till early January. Uh, we're hoping we're going to do a couple of vlogs from this event. Uh, obviously, as you can see, Vampire will be open during the event, so we can't wait to get back on Vampire because, sadly, during Halloween, we couldn't get on it because it had about a 60-minute queue. So, um, we, to be honest, we, we don't really want to be waiting an hour for Vampire because even when it's on a half-an-hour queue, it takes forever it takes forever to do it, but um, yeah, uh, Chesington Winters Tale is on the cards for this year. Um, like I say, once again, this is another event that was due to start during lockdown uh, and is likely to be cancelled or delayed until lockdown ends. So uh, make sure you're subscribed so you get to find out uh, all the news about it. But yeah, Chesington Winters Tale is the second event on the lineup. And the final event that I'm going to announce now that we're going to be going to over the Christmas period is uh, Legoland Windsor um, at Christmas. Uh, this is an event we sadly missed out on for the last two years, um, but we're definitely going to try and get down to it. Uh, obviously, this one is an event which runs from late November until early January. Uh, of course, this is likely to be starting now in early December. Uh, due to the lockdown. To be honest, we are really excited for uh, Legoland at Christmas. Uh, to be honest, Legoland at Christmas is one of the, uh, one of our highly anticipated events this year. Um, we always enjoy going to Legoland Windsor and obviously the Dragon will be open. Uh, we absolutely love the Dragon. It's, I feel the Dragon is such an underrated coaster and um, 
it's not even a proper um, roller coaster manufactured ride. It's like it's made by a transportation company, which is weird. Uh, but yeah, but of course there's going to be loads of other events we're going to be uh, going to over the winter. Uh, so definitely keep an eye out on my social media and on uh, the National Vlogs community page here on YouTube for when we announce more stuff. As I'm sure, I'm sure once lockdown ends, we'll sort of get to find out more about uh, maybe what's been cancelled and what hasn't. So guys, thank you very much for watching this video. If you did enjoy it, make sure to leave a like. Uh, don't forget to comment. Uh, and let me know what you'd like to see uh, content-wise during lockdown. Uh, would you like to see roller coaster reviews? That's one of them I want to do. I want to do a couple of roller coaster reviews and stuff like that. Uh, and also, if you are new around here, make sure to subscribe because we are now 29 away from the big 400 uh, milestone. It would be a dream for me to hit 400 uh, hopefully by Christmas or by 2021. So make sure you like, comment and subscribe. Tell your friends to subscribe, tell your friends to subscribe, your, your mum, your dad, your sister, even your dog. If your dog can access YouTube, then um, let them, you know, let them subscribe because I, I just can't wait uh, to hit 400. Anyway, guys, I've been Nasha. This has been another video on Nasha Vlogs. Stay safe, guys. One last thing. At the time of recording, tomorrow on the 1st of November 2020, I will be making my last uh, Merlin sort of theme park trip of the main season. Uh, I will be at the final day of Fort Park Fright Nights Festival. Guys, if you're on park, say hi. I, I love seeing you guys and those who have... Um, come up and said hi to me over the uh, over the Halloween season. It, it means a lot to know that people appreciate me on this um, platform. Anyway, I'm going to get out of it. Like, comment and subscribe. I've been Nasha. This has been another video on Nasha Vlogs. Thanks for a brilliant summer and scare season. It's time to be locked down before those festive bells start ringing once again. Thanks, guys. Be good people. Wear your masks. Stay at home. Look, I could even be in charge of the country, really. I reckon I could do a better job. I'm joking. Anyway, guys, I'm going to get out of here. Be good people. That's what I want you guys to be during this time. Be good people, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace out.